Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Outlook error. That is the required file out lrpc.dll cannot be found in your path. Install Microsoft Outlook once again. So if you're receiving this error message, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to go ahead and restart your computer. So go to the start menu, click on the power icon and then click on restart. And after the restart, try to launch Outlook. Still you are facing the problem, go ahead and update Windows 10. To update Windows 10, go to the start menu, click on settings, then click on update and security, and then click on check for update. And once the update is installed, restart your computer and then try to launch Outlook once again. Now still you are facing the problem, then you can go ahead and repair office. So open run box, just go ahead and type in run in Windows search and open run box and go ahead and type in app Wiz dot cpl and then click on ok and here find uh, go ahead and find microsoft office so here you can see microsoft office just make a right click and then click on change then click on yes to allow and go ahead and run a quick repair so select this and then click on repair and then restart your computer and then try to launch outlook still you are facing the problem then again come to this place and then select online repair this time and then click on repair and that should go ahead and fix the problem for you now still you are facing the problem then go ahead and run this microsoft easy fix tool so copy this link the link is provided in the video description so copy this link and then open any browser and then open this link scroll down and here you can find the option which says download so click on download and run this exe file and then click on easy fix and click on next now when this is when you're running this uh, microsoft easy fix tool make sure that you don't have any office application running so uh, right now the word is open so that's why i received this error message so let me close this and then you can go ahead and select this and then click on next and after that, you can go ahead and try to launch Office. Now, still you are facing the problem. Then use uh, Microsoft Support and Recovery Assistant. So copy this link. This link is also provided in the video description. Then open any browser and then open this link and go ahead and download Microsoft Support and Reco Recovery Assistant. So click on download. This will download the exe file. You have to go ahead and run this exe file and then install Microsoft Support and Recovery Assistant on your computer and then launch it. It will take a couple of seconds to launch and after that go ahead and select Outlook and then click on Next and here you can see different uh, problems which you can go ahead and fix it so select the appropriate uh, you know the problem whatever problem you're facing so here you can see outlook won't start and you if uh, you don't find your issue over here then you can select other problems and then you can click on next and then follow the on screen instruction to go ahead and fix your outlook issue still you're facing the problem you can go ahead and uninstall and reinstall office to uninstall office you can use again Microsoft support and recovery assistance so you can go ahead and launch it and then you can go ahead and select office and then click on next and you can select the option which says I have office installed but I'm having trouble uninstalling it select this then click on next and it is asking is this the affected machine you can select yes and then click on next and it will go ahead and identify the office product and then you can put a check and then click on next it will go ahead and uninstall it now after the uninstall restart your computer go to the start menu and then click on restart and after the restart go ahead and download and install office from microsoft website so if you have digital copy if you don't have a dvd or cd you bought a digital download you can go to microsoft.com so go ahead. this link is also provided in the video description so go to account.microsoft.com and then log into your account on the top right you will see the sign in option so click on sign in then log into your microsoft account and then you can go 
and click on services and subscription once you log in click on services and subscription and once you click on it you will be able to see your office over here and then you have to click on view product key and install now once you click on view product key and install you will be able to see your office and then select your office and then click on install and after the installation you can go ahead and configure your outlook once again and you can use microsoft outlook now in case you are using cd or a dvd then make sure that you have the license key to activate office after the installation it will ask for license key so make sure that you have the license key before you uninstall uh, in case if you have a cd or a dvd and here you can see how to install a different version of office on your computer so these these links i have provided in the video description so you can get it from there so one of the steps should help you to get rid of this error message so that will be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel